Keith Arsenault here with head coach Tom Poitras following a 0-0 tie against the Binghamton Bearcats. Coach, it seemed from minute one you guys were on the attack, 20 shots on the game, constantly attacking Binghamton's goal. Did you come out and try and get the ball forward? Well, I mean, we, we wanted to try and press the issue tonight. We knew, you know, we came off the loss during the midweek. The guys were energetic. They were excited to get back on the field, and, and we wanted to try and press the issue and push forward. Um, and I thought we did a really good job of that, you know, and, and I thought actually we did a pretty good job of managing their few counterattacks as well. But, you know, I mean, honestly, the, the, the real story of our night is not being able to finish in the final third. You know, so unfortunately, you know, we get 20 shots, we get 10 corner kicks, we get our chances, but we don't create a, you know, have anything to show for it, so. Defensively limiting the chances for Binghamton, and when you, they did have an opportunity, you were ob oftentimes counterattacking and, and making an opportunity out of it yourself. Can you talk a little bit about tonight's defense? Yeah, I mean, you know, Damien and Jamie and Rohan did a really good job with Blake, the four of them. Um, you know, and I thought Aleko and, and Romario did a good job in the center midfield because you're right, we won some balls and we were able to, to counter on them a little bit, especially in the first half we got forward, uh, you know, and caught them coming forward. The second half, they didn't come out as much. They did a very good job of packing the defense and staying organized, making it hard for us to get through. But we, we didn't have as many chances in the second half to counter, but we th thought maybe Giovanni could have gotten around the corner a couple times in the first half, and maybe we would have got a little more out of that. This week you step out of conference, you head to Northeastern for a midweek matchup. That out of conference game, what does that allow you to do with the team and work on some things outside of a conference opponent? Well, I mean, Northeastern's very good. You know, it's a, a really good game for us at this point in the season. Um, they were in the top 25 last year, went to the second round of the NCAA tournament, so we're excited to have them, you know, this week. And, and what it'll do is we'll get a chance to see some different faces maybe, you know, and give some guys a chance maybe that haven't been getting on as much lately. And, and then also, you know, look at some different combinations, um, you know, to be able to see who matches up well for the last three games down the stretch during the league. Well, three games remaining before the Hawks return to Al Marzouk Field. They'll head to Northeastern this week, and then they'll have road games in conference at Stony Brook and at Albany before wrapping up the regular season right here at Al Marzouk Field against UMass Lowell next month in November. For now, though, for HartfordHawks.com, I'm Keith Arsenault with head coach Tom Poitras.